Good morning, Roll Runners. Welcome to another great day of teaching and learning at Humphreys Elementary School, where we are critical thinkers, active learners, and future leaders. I'm Kaden. And I'm Messiah, and we are anchored for today's news show. Before bringing you the top news, please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance and remain standing for the Humphreys Pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. We the students at Humphreys Elementary School pledge to meet and exceed all our goals for academic excellence. We pledge to become independent thinkers, responsible learners, and law-abiding citizens. Furthermore, we pledge our best efforts to make our parents, teachers, and our community proud. And we build our foundation to become tomorrow's leader. Thank you. You may be seated. Please pause for a moment of silent reflection to reflect upon today's activities. The character words of the month are self-control. Self-control means being able to express and deal with strong feelings in appropriate ways. Children who exhibit self-control can wait their turn when playing a game, can refrain from hitting others when they're mad, and can wait for recognition or gratification. Self-control involves thinking skills as we decide which of our feelings to act on. Our I will statement of the day is, repeat after me. I will practice self-control in all that I do. This ensures that you will make every attempt to remain in total control of your feelings and actions. Not Fire Weather, brought to you by our guest meteorologist from WSB-TV, Channel 2 News. Our meteorologist, Ashley Cramlin. You're planning on getting outside for the next several days, giving you the green light, but it is going to be much colder. Starting off with some clouds throughout the morning, we'll rebound with some more sunshine. Upper 50s, this is though for highs, but then the cold air that really starts to sink in. A big dip in the jet stream is going to send in a rush of some Arctic air. More sunshine as we finish out the week with a chance of showers rolling into the weekend. For weather updates, tune into the Channel 2 News weather segment or use the Channel 2 Weather to Weather app for updates to your local weather. And now for the morning announcements. Today is March 14th, 2023. Happy Pi Day! Pi Day is an annual celebration of the mathematical constant Pi. Pi is observed on March 14th since 3, 1, and 4 are the three most significant figures represented by Pi in its decimal representation. Pi is the ratio of a circle's circumference to its diameter. While learning about Pi is usually a fifth grade skill, the experience of Pi Day will be shared with all of us throughout the building. So stay tuned for a special treat. So when you think of Pi, think Pi. It's Women's History Month. A time for us to celebrate the achievements and contributions of women in our history books. Let's take a look at a few of those contributions.
Today, you will participate in a school-wide Pi Day celebration. Chef Ashley Keys with ChoicesForKids.org has invited each of you to be a part of the Snack and Storytime virtual field trip. The celebration will involve you being able to create your own pie and participate in a read aloud of Happy Pie Day to You by Bonnie Worth. Be sure to enjoy your virtual field trip and show your road runner best. This week, we will take the assessment. Be sure to get a good night's nice rest, eat a good breakfast, and come prepared to do your best. Okay, road runners, let's get this growth. GMAS tutorial and prep program continues today. Students who have been invited to attend, please remain with your teachers so that you can be taken to the designated area. Bingo! We are in the middle of our March book bingo competition, where STEM books and categories are the selections for this month. Here's how you play. Read a book from a category from the list below. Take an AR quiz and score at least 80%. Write the name of the book and the score in the box and you're well on your way. The more rows you complete, the more chances you have to win. I wonder who will be our March book bingo champion. Will it be you? This is your weekly help check. check. Do you really have a bad cough? Are you sneezing a lot? Well, we are currently in the midst of flu and allergy season. It's when people get sick from trees, plants, and other animals, or simply from viruses that we may contract from touching different surfaces. In an effort to keep everyone safe, we would like to encourage everyone to wash your hands. It's our easiest way to stop the transmission of illnesses and minimize some of the coughing and sneezing that you will experience. And now for birthdays. Happy birthday to Casey Reed Jr., Giovanni Rose, Zachariah Sanders, and Zane Stilwell. We hope you enjoy your special day. Please come to the office to receive your birthday prize. Those are all the announcements that we have for you today. And it's time for us to sign off. But remember, there are no bad days in Humphreys, only good or great days. So let's make this a great one. Have an amazing day, Roadrunners.